Today's tutorial, how to sign PDF files in C-sharp using Iron PDF. What is up guys? Today, we're gonna learn how to sign PDFs using Iron PDF. I've already installed Iron PDF using the NuGet Package Manager. So we're just gonna go ahead and skip to the fun stuff, the code. So let's go to the program.cs file and check it out. All right, so first we need the necessary namespaces, which is Iron PDF and Iron PDF.signing. Uh, as well as ironsoftware.drawing to use the crop rectangle method, which is responsible for the image coordinates and dimensions. So remember to set your IMPDF license key here. Um, whether you have a paid or trial license key, you wanna input that right here. Now let's run a simple HTML to a PDF using the Chrome PDF renderer. In our case, we have a heading saying foo. We then save the PDF to a file named signed.pdf. All right, so now comes the cool part, creating and setting up the digital signature. We create a PDF signature object and provide the path to the digital signature. And in this case, ironsoftware.pfx along with its password. A pretty cool feature is that Iron PDF allows us to add granular information to the PDF signature. So we can specify the signature date, uh, contact, location, and even the reason for the signing. So for our example, uh, we've set these, these values here accordingly. Next, we provide a URL to a timestamp server and set the signature image property, giving it uh, the path to an image file and the crop dimensions to use for the signature. Finally, we sign our PDF document using the sign PDF file method on our PDF signature object. And now that the code is ready, let's go ahead and run it. Program is running, so we'll wait uh, for the program to execute. All right, program has executed successfully. So let's examine our signed PDF. All signatures are valid in this PDF. And if you notice this image, this represents our digital signature. So let's click on it to view the details. And here we have the details of our digital signature, the date, location, contact, and reason for signing, exactly as we specified in our code. And these links are working and everything is properly signed. So that's it. That's how you add a digital signature to a PDF uh, using Iron PDF. Thanks for watching the tutorial. We hope that it was helpful. And don't forget to subscribe if you're digging these tutorials from Iron Software. And if you'd like to check out the software and experience the power of it firsthand, you can click on the link for the trial in the description below.